Oh, dude, Donatella Versace. That bitch is ugly as fuck. My gosh, she's hideous, man. Fuck. That bitch. Oh, dude, that shit makes my dick go limp, man. Seriously. There's a, I like pussy. There's very few uh, situations and where I would turn down pussy. Uh, and Donatella Versace, apparently she's famous uh, for being ugly as fuck. Uh, dude, I'm sorry, man. Uh, I would pass that up in a heartbeat. My dick would be inverted, man, if I was even in the same room with her. My dick would be like, no, motherfucker, I ain't even giving the option of coming out and partying with this ugly ass bitch. <laughs> oh, and that cat lady, the one who spent like $4 million to make her face look like a cat, that bitch is beyond freakish, man. That's like your worst nightmare, waking up to that shit. Like you went home with her at the bar, you woke up in the morning, oh, what the fuck is wrong with your face? <laughs> her and Mickey Rourke look almost identical. Ugly as fuck. Due to fucked up plastic surgery. Oh, could you imagine the kid they would have? No, because this plastic surgery, so the kid might actually look okay. I don't even know what that lady even looks like without her fucking face like that. Worst foursome ever. Rosie O'Donnell, Mama June, Donatella Versace, and the woman who wants to be the cat. Oh. You, your penis could never recover, man. You would be permanently fucked up. You'd be in therapy for years. Hey, what happened to that dude? You don't want to talk about it. He saw them all naked and their faces in the light. The room wasn't dark enough. Fuck. Oh, imagine being tortured, man. Being given two Viagras and then chained down to a bed. And one in a row, they all come in that room one at a time. First Mama June smearing that fat, nasty inbred puss all over your face. And then Rosie comes in and she has a dick, so she fucks you. And then Donatella Versace walks in and you think it's like Night of the Living Dead because that bitch is ugly as fuck. And then that cat lady comes in on all fours. <sighs> Dude. <laughs> Nightmare. There ain't no therapy that can take care of that. Dr. Phil could not fix that shit ever. Hey, you permanently fucked up. I'm sorry, man. Someone in their inner circle needs to tell them, you are ugly as fuck. You need to stop posing for pictures. Uh, you are the laughing stock in every picture that you take. Um, we should just put you down out of your misery, uh, out of our misery, so we don't have to look at your ugly ass face. I know I'm not uh, a perfect 10 by any stretch of the imagination. I'm not trying to say that, but if you put my face next to Donatella Versace's face, whew, I look better than fucking Brad Pitt. What's up? Cause that bitch is ugly as fuck. I feel bad though, cause she does a lot of charity work. I guess. I don't know if she. I don't know who would want her to represent you from charity though. Hey, well, we'd like you to be uh, the face of our uh, company, dude. I don't want that bitch's face. I don't want to see her ever again. And it's fucked up, man. These websites, Yahoo. I wake up in the morning. I check my phone. Boom. They just put that picture up. Ow. Way to start my day. Looking at your face, making my penis inverted. Thank you. Thanks, Yahoo. <laughs>